I wanted to climb Kilimanjaro because they told us that we'd go on a safari at the end. When I was on Kilimanjaro, when we was walking, I was walking on my own for a little bit because I just, I've been with people for a long time. And um, so I was walking on my own, but I knew that there was a guide behind me. I carried on and then when I looked behind, he wasn't there. So we had a bit of a panic attack and cried, but then I found everyone again. I thought I was lost in Africa. The altitude sickness made me struggle a lot on the mountain because it made me feel really sick and I thought I couldn't carry on, but I made it to the top still. I also felt quite homesick and I couldn't really contact my family because I was in Africa, so that made me struggle. I appreciate more everyday things like going to the toilet, so that's affecting my life now because it was really hard, but I'd still always work with charities and give money to charities. I just tell them to train and think about it properly.